Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you the brand new Extreme body. If you are watching this video, you are going to be one of the first seeing this body even before it's in the market. But before that, I'm going to talk a little bit about bodies and how important they are. I know that in those days the RC bodies look a little bit ugly and not like real cars. But the truth is that the bodies are one of the most important things in our RC cars. And I would say like through the years, in the last 10 years, we improved like 5-6 seconds in 5 minutes, which is impressive. And that's probably why the brands, the body brands, are coming out all the time with new bodies. Because the body can really make a huge difference on your car. I'm sure that at this time of the video are like, come on Bruni, show me the body. Let's do it. It looks promising, right? So, downforce and drag are the two most important things in aerodynamics. And that's what David Lopini, that is the engineer of extreme aerodynamics, is always trying to find to get better. More downforce, less drag. Let's try to explain a little bit what it's downforce and drag. So, downforce is basically what pushes your car down, what generates the grip. And drag, it's basically what stucks your car on the track, like what we don't make you carry the speed. So there are two very difficult things to fight with. You always want more downforce, but also your car to have the speed. So it's easy to make a huge wing, which will generate more downforce, but then your car will not have any speed. So that's the hard work of Lopini, is trying to make your car to have the best speed as possible, not stopping on the track and generating the most downforce as possible. Let's check this body. So the new body has a completely different shape. As you can see, like the, now it's much more aggressive with all this thing in the front. It looks pretty nice actually, I like it. Also the front lip was also redesigned. As you can see now here you have less space and then here you have more. So you have the front kind of a harrow. And one of the things that was completely changed was the wheel arch, as you can see. It's completely different and here look at this detail this thing here it's a kind of a road for the wind like the wind will enter here and kind of follow all the sides on here on the side of the door so basically this is what i was talking about the drag so the most that you can flow the hair and the hair doesn't stuck on something you know it's kind of flow and don't, don't create any turbulence the the best uh, drag you have so the less drag you have and that's what Lopini tried to make on this body was to generate the less drag as possible with the most downforce as possible so comparing to the twister this body should have more downforce a little bit more but much less drag so the body should carry much more speed than the twister let's now look to the rear the rear was also completely redesigned and I think it's one of the best thing on this body and a new future that I think it's, it's gonna be very, very nice. It's this thing, check this out. If I can find it, if I can put it there. I don't understand nothing about this. Why, why nobody give me a radio to the hand and I can put this on place? Okay, as you can see this, check the angle of the wing. So the support on here, it's completely flat, but the wing has a angle. So basically, this is the same thing as is used in a Formula One, that they have the support of the wing very high. And that's what you can see in those days in, a, in the GT cars, like a, the Porsche GT3, like the, the, the support for the wing is super high and then the wing is not that big and with angle. So basically this is to generate more downforce and less drag. So basically the hair is not gonna stuck here on the wing, it's gonna flow, but the, the height of the support, it will generate more traction with the wing angle like this. And also the good feature of this, it's that 
Extreme is gonna do, I think, two or three different wings with the different angles. So then you can tune it, you can change the wing with more downforce or less downforce. That's for sure very, very nice. Also the details they make here on the rear supports, as you can see, let me push this here. These details here on the wings, on the supports, for the hair to flow and doesn't stuck here, it's also very nice with all these details here. It's also very nice. Another detail that they make was the roof. The roof now is going to be a little bit lower also again to make a little bit less drag. So the roof is going to be a little bit lower than the twister. So I think in the hands that's all this body should be very, very nice and will be soon on the market. So I hope guys you enjoy the video. See you on the track.